Hey ghosts and ghouls and welcome back to my channel. Um, so today I'm going to show you everything that I've bought decoration wise this year. So it's going to be like a Halloween haul decoration thing. I'm filming in my lounge today because I've got a lot of stuff. Um, so the animals go loopy in the lounge so if they make any sounds, screams, whatever, it's because they're mental. Okay. Um, so I'm going to start with um, this little box here of stuff that I got from Poundland. So first of all, there's this little dead rat that I got and he is a uh, pretty uh, creepy and he's going to be a good little decoration to hang out. Um, I've also got this here which is, looks like a coffin and it says Dracula's Tavern Fresh Blood Daily. And I've got multiple pictures hanging up around this room, so I'll just switch this from one of the photos. And yeah, make it look a bit freaky. Um, these aren't anything decoration wise, but I picked up some types. So I've got some stripy ones, and these ones here, which have got bats on them. Um, I've also got some barbed wire which is going to be good just to pin up around the room and make it look nice and freaky. Um, I like this freaky fabric which we've got here, which would just be great for decorating. Put it on the window, then add some lights behind it, make it look creepy. Um, I also got a zipper kit from Panlan and I might do a video for the Halloween videos, but I'm near the end now, so going forward I will be putting special effects videos on my channel um, so this might be one I might do I probably won't do like the classic face of blood I think I want to do something different so keep an eye out for that and from Poundland I also got this is the last thing um, but I got some a table cover with like a little scar on and some spiders and that'd be nice over the table. I've got a wooden table, so it'll just poke through and it'll look lovely. Um, I bought these scene setters when I was on holiday for my birthday. So they're like zombie ones, and you just place them up in the room, and yeah, that's the freaky scene. So I've got a blank wall over there near my table, so I'll probably put them all up there I reckon. I also picked up this um, little sparkly spider from the place we went to for my birthday and he's really cute. He's just like a little cute little spider that's not that scary but yeah he's cool. Um, I then went to the range and I only got a couple of things from here. Well Chris got these for me. Um, so I've got this man here. I'll just turn him on for you and I'm gonna put him on my door. And he's um, pretty cool and hopefully he'll scare all the kids because that's the main object of Halloween, scaring children. <clears throat> um, and I also got a load of these photos. So they basically look like normal photos and when you move them they have like a horror picture on them. I can't, don't know if you can see them but I end up buying one, two, three, four six of them. So we've got these ones and these ones. I don't even know if you can see them but and they were like 40p each so they were really cheap. Um, and then the last place which we went to to get Halloween stuff was B&M. We picked up this cool little dude here which was £12.99 and he just goes into the ground so we've got a mound out in the front of our house and we're going to put him down there. Um, we got two sets of strobe lights so we've bought a little strobe light for indoors to shine against something that we set up which is going to be freaky and we've also got a big strobe light here which is a strobe a thunder strobe so it's sound and light so you plug it in and it flashes and it also makes some freaky dicky sounds and I think this one was £12.99 
and the small one was £2.69. Um, I also picked up some um, orange lights which go in your windows, so they're perfect for your windows, and these are £2.99 and I'll put them underneath my freaky fabric. Um, I bought some more creepy fabric but this one is in a shade of white. Um, I've bought a doormat for the front door and this doormat was £1.99 from B&M. We've also got this toilet seat cover which is a pound and you just put that on your toilet and then this bit on the toilet and then that bit on where the water's kept. Do you like that one Oscar? And I've got this, it's a screaming doormat sensor and um, it's meant to scream when you stand on it but this one doesn't work so I'm going to have to go back and get it replaced but this was 4 I also got some balloons which I've got hand prints on and these were a pound and I also last of all got some cobwebs so this one's a six foot black shimmering web and this is 2 and it's huge and I've got the classic black cobwebs which was 1 for a massive bag and that's the end of what we got this year for our Halloween decorations. Um, I hope you enjoyed seeing what I got. If you get anything like this, show me how you decorate your house. And um, yeah, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Oscar says bye. Bye. <laughs>